Yo, what is up everybody? Today we're gonna try something new. We're gonna be playing Man 16 Ultimate Team and we're going to be doing a pack and play, but not with Madden packs. We're gonna be using real life packs right here. Some real life trading cards. You see Barry Sanders on the cover. There are four packs in here. We're gonna be opening these packs and then we're gonna build our team based on who we pull and do a nice pack and play. All right, we are back. The boxes opened up. We got our cards. I don't know what's in these, man, so. We're hoping for a good, complete team. Hopefully a few superstars. Maybe like a Rob Gronkowski or something like that. So, so we got Derek Carr to start things off out of this pack. That's our quarterback. And I, I'm hoping we get someone better. We can use a goal and take a Derek Carr. That's actually pretty sick compared to what we're doing. You guys see right here, we got ourselves a Carlos Hyde. Ooh, Jimmy Graham. I like this. I like a Jimmy Graham. We could probably use a flashback Jimmy Graham right here. By the way, people are making jokes about hairline and stuff like that. Might as well show you guys. Uh, there's no hairline problem. I'm young. I don't have a hairline problem. We do have a problem with this guy, though. This is Paul Richardson. You might not be able to recognize him because he doesn't really play. He definitely doesn't have a good card in Mutt. So we could definitely use a Kadeem Carry. I just realized I've been looking at my laptop the whole time and not my camera. So I've probably been holding the cards like an idiot. So I apologize for that. But let's hop on through. I don't even know what we got here. This is... Oh my god, this is a Luke Keekly. This is a very odd looking Luke Keekly. So I'm going to check this out, man. Someone let me know exactly what we got on our hands here. Ourselves, Marquise Lee. This is kind of useless. I think he has a campus... Actually, campus hero card might be like a 90-something overall. So actually, I take that back, Marquise. We're, we're straight, man. We're straight. Let's see what we got here. I'm holding it upside down. This is Gale Sayers, man. This is Gale Sayers. If we were doing like a flashback legend thing, oh man, Gale Sayers, he's the man. I can't believe we can't use him. See who else we got? We got Russell Wilson. All right, all right. I think Russell Wilson has a golden ticket. Ooh, Lil Geo. Lil Geo might have to be the starting running back, man. You guys know I like Lil Geo from my Bleed the Man 25 budget squad. I think I'll put him over to Dean Carey, even though Carey has a better card. Great. We need another great defensive player. Obviously, Lil Kiku is great. And, ooh. Ooh. Check it out. That is Julio Jones. We Now we got ourselves a receiving core, man. We got Julio Jones. Who do we got here, man? Who do we got here? Terrence West. Um, it's a signature play card. It's got something really cool in the inside. I'm not sure exactly what that is, but he is completely useless to us because he doesn't really have a good card. This is in the NFL. Is this Dez? This is Dez Bryant, baby. This is Dez Bryant. Our receiving core is special, man. Our receiving core is definitely special. Charles Sim right here, man. Eh, we don't really need Charles Sim. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'll catch you guys with the team. Definitely gonna have fun doing this. Yo, what's up, guys? Our pack and play team has been created, including Dez, Julio, Russell Wilson. I got the 95 Russell Wilson instead of the 99 one. I didn't feel like getting the golden ticket. You guys see the team around, Kiki, etc. Now, since we didn't pull many defensive players or any offensive line or anything like that, I just put some random players around them, trying not to make the team too overpowered, though I did put the likes of Golden Ticket, Strong Safety, Bo Jackson, and 99 Campus Hero, Eric Berry, or Campus Legend, Eric Berry, making his debut on the squad i should say is my opponent going downfield and it's incomplete intended for williams fourth down breeze passing the ball got a man got a first down williams this time answers the bell that was a big chance for us to get off the field early on but we were not able to answer as you see runs the ball with that 99 flashback quentin portis and that was definitely his mo he wanted to run the ball first but we crack him right there with Barry. the ball goes out of bounds next to the referee though so he gets to keep possession and move the chains right here Williams oh joking and jiving finally brought down by Dion Buchanan but as you guys see here he's trying to establish the run and then open up the passing game based on us accounting for the run we have to make sure we stop the run but Clinton Portis goes in the end zone and puts up the game's first point so far not so great but our team was created on the offensive end and that's where we have our stars like Dez like Julio like Jimmy Graham Russell Wilson though unfortunately Unfortunately, not able to find anything. This guy was sending pressure throughout the game. As you guys see, he sends a four-man rush right there. Then we do find Charles Sims, who stiff arms his way for a nice little gain. Third and five, running the ball. Sims going nowhere. I started Sims because he was the fastest running back. Why not? Fourth down and six. We're going for it, and we are not able to get it. Maybe going for it was not the smart decision. I was a little bit mad that we gave the fourth down earlier to him, and I guess that kind of, you know, got me to go for it myself. Normally, I would just punt the ball in that situation. That wasn't smart, and he 
ended up sacking us third down and five already near field goal range but he gives it all up to eric berry who's reversing fields oh berry might have had a touchdown if number 31 i believe Cromarty picked up a block as sims goes nowhere both run games you know a little iffy right now as we run the screen pass to charles sims and oh man we need some blocks right now that might have been a crib call right there third down and 11 pressure again and down goes russell wilson we are struggling on the offensive end fourth down going for it out of frustration and we don't get it intended for the campus here of marquise lee right now i'm just having the most random meltdown <laughs> like it's seven nothing but i'm playing as if it's 35 nothing though right now it is 14 zip after Amari Cooper catches that touchdown, and I gotta get my head in the game quickly. I gotta stop making dumb reads, dumb decisions, and just let Des Bryant and Julio Jones do their thing. So we get Des Bryant a drag route just to get him in the flow, and then hopefully that opens up more of the game. Just like how he ran the ball to open up the passing game. That's what we're gonna try to do. We're gonna run little drag routes and stuff like that to open up the deep shot, little screen passes. But here comes the pressure. Thankfully, we are able to find Julio on the post route really quickly after the two-minute warning. Looking to take a deep shot for Des Bryant downfield. Oh, we had a touchdown, but Russell Wilson misses the open golden ticket. Man. Maybe I should have gotten the golden ticket, Russell Wilson. Oh, Julio Jones did not care about that single coverage. The aggressive, aggressive catch cheese right there on this play as Charles Sims takes the ball to the three-yard line. We're milking a little bit of clock at the goal line, trying to punch it in. Badly needing seven, but we actually lose two yards right there. Big third down and goal. Wilson pressure. Touchdown, Dez. Brian throw up the X, the golden ticket, Dez finally gets in the end zone, and now like I said, we have to make smart decisions, even though we're under pressure, and now with 21 seconds left, just make sure he doesn't get a field goal, we're out in three man deep, preventing the deep ball, and thankfully we punch it away, and it's almost picked off by Bo Jackson on the ricochet, 15 seconds left, he still intends on passing the ball in the corner, it's picked off, golden ticket, strong safety, Bo Jackson making an impact right there, right before half, trying to take a shot, it's Dez, it's a catch, it's a touchdown, and the game is tied up at 14 apiece, we played like garbage for pretty much all but a minute of that first half, this guy should have a 14 point lead, but he doesn't have much to show for it, instead, it's 14-14, and here we are with ball coming out of half, all the momentum, looking to take a deep shot, oh, we had RB, if I had an extra second, I was letting that loose, but Trent Murphy gets in Russell Wilson's face, second down, looking to take a shot for Dez Bryant, one on one, Dez, oh my, Dez Bryant is taking over this game, oh, offensively, single handedly, and now, it's time to make a good read you can throw up all the lob tricks you want but every once in a while you got to make a good read even though you got the golden ticket and the positional hero and all that stuff and thankfully we did right there and now we are up with a quick 21 to 0 run this guy has to be stunned he played a smart game he got us frustrated on defense and now second down and 10 he's the one that's to make sure he doesn't get frustrated and stays throughout with his game plan third down and 10 pressure here oh but he throws it up and it's actually a catch right there a little bit of a rocky catch you see breeze a little bit of an iffy game right now as he goes back to the corner oh man right at Cromartie but he's not able to break that one up now he's at the 26 yard line running a screen oh boy Eric Perry look at that acceleration to the ball and all the way to the crib Eric Perry campus legend oh man you guys know I'm a big Barry fan, so that made me feel good. And I can't believe we got that pick. That was all the 98 speed of Eric Barry right there. Not many safeties in the game or players in the game, period could have jumped that route and taken it for six as you guys see he's continuing to try to run the ball but we've been doing a great job since the first quarter and controlling the ground game forcing him to win this game in the air and he gets knocked down to the ground four down and 11 this could be the game right here as he comes out passing lobbing it up oh it is caught by amari cooper can't really be mad about that because we've been aggressive catching all throughout the game first down corner open got it amari cooper answers the bell again and that's going to take us to the final quarter clinton ford is outside fighting and that's a touchdown and that cuts the lead to seven one possession game we have to be smart as we give it to des bryant on the drag route once again 
Dez is just so elusive off the catch as we run a fullback dive to Avili right there. But Dez can also get those one-on-one -on -one jump balls. As you guys see, we're milking the clock trying to protect our lead. Charles Sims, we haven't had any success in the run game. So we're probably going to have to pass the ball for the first down. We go to the flat. Sims fighting. And Sims gets a nice game right there. Brings up a third down and short. We have to be aware of the pressure he's sending. And there it is. Down we go. Trying to get it to Dez Bryant. But Eddie Goldman brings us down. On fourth down, we make a ridiculous decision. We are going for it we are lobbing it we are converting Dez Brian this guy is unstoppable and that should all but do the game maybe one more first down oh Sims loses it rocked ball out change of possession and now this game is far from over breeze back on the field a chance to tie or take the lead with a touchdown maybe a two-point conversion who knows but first let's make sure he gets a touchdown let's make sure he gets a first down and he does to the outside to williams who suffers a hit himself minute four left he has all three of his timeouts drew breeze looking throwing got it once again but we're forcing him to throw it short knowing that we got just have to guard the end zone these short routes are fine with us this run game is fine with us and we got it all bottled up eric berry with the tackle he calls his first timeout. 47 seconds left. Third and one. Drew Brees with the ball going downfield. It's picked off. That is Burns. That is a rookie coming up with the biggest play. Pretty much the game clinching play right there. Now we're not taking any chances. I'm just kneeing this ball out. I'm not fumbling the goddamn ball again. So we need it three times. He had two timeouts. We're punting the ball with eight seconds left. Hoping he returns this and ends the game. But he's going to smartly call for a fair catch. So with three seconds left this sets up a hail mary he needs the touchdown obviously here could be the last play breeze in the pocket got time downfield lobbing it off it's cut it is cut but he's down at the eight yard line cooper hauls it in but touchdown by berry and that is the ball game spectacular finish right there we hang on for the win man we had three big players in this game des bryant Eric Berry and Bo Jackson. Leave a like on this video if you guys enjoyed the game. If you guys enjoyed the pack and play. If you guys want to see more of that, let me know in the comment section. Subscribe for more Man 16. And I'll catch you guys next time.